Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Naomi and I create travel contents here on YouTube. But right now, Malaysia is under lockdown and there's nowhere that I can travel to. So I'm trying to be creative here and I'm going to bring you grocery shopping with me. Hear me out. Whenever I travel, I like to go to the local grocery stores and supermarkets just to look at what are the variety of things that they have, the local produce, what brands they have that I don't have back at home. So I thought it would be kind of interesting for you to see what Malaysian supermarkets have, how the pricing differs in Malaysia and in your home country. So yeah, let's go check out how much a bunch of bananas costs here in Malaysia and then you can let me know in the comments how much it costs in your country. Alright, so we've arrived at the shopping mall. This is my list right here. Um, there's not a lot on my list today because earlier last week I already did grocery shopping and I have some of the protein back at home. I usually plan my groceries for like one and a half weeks to two weeks. So let's go. Alright, so here is what it looks like. I just got my cart. Let me show you how much this is going to so usually I would go for like a 5 ringgit plus one and that would give me like 5 bananas. I'll just get myself maybe like this one because it's like 4 ringgit plus for 5. So let me check my list. I think I'll get like a watermelon. Oh my god this is so weird. So I'm getting a watermelon. I can't finish like the entire one so I'm getting a slice one. Um, I need avocado. I really love avocados but it's imported product and it's really expensive. It's like 1990 or sometimes like 1890 for just three. Oh, expensive. Alright, so I got some avocados and the middle one is a little bit soft so I can already start eating. Uh, the other two I'll just wait a few days for it to ripen. Alright, so now it's time for the vegetables. Vegetables. So avocado is there. Zucchini, red pepper, carrot, baby kailan, and onion. Oh, I don't need cucumber. Oh, I guess I'm not eating salad. So here I'm getting the baby kailan. Oh, no, it's baby. Oh, baby kailan is here. Here I'm gonna get a bell pepper in red color and yellow color. Color one, uh, yellow color one. Yeah. Should I get a green one too? Green one is cheaper. Uh, I think I'll get a yellow and a red. Okay. So here is section to different areas. Yeah, mushrooms. I'm not addicted to mushrooms. Please say they have zucchini. Oh yes! Oh my gosh, I love zucchinis and it's really hard to find because I guess it's kind of seasonal. Okay. Zucchini I need a one corn but they only sell it in two so I'll just get mashed corn, sweet corn, pearl sweet corn. Okay, look at the price. I think sweet corn is fine. Okay, so they have carrot here, but it's under the organic section. Three ringgit fifty cents for an organic carrot. Okay, no, that's actually kind of expensive, so I don't think I want it. I'm cheap skate. So let me just show you the seafood section. I won't be buying any seafood because early last week I just bought some. So there's this tank of fresh seafood and like the cut fish there. So here there is the fjord fish. This is the size. And then there's the salmon fish. Oh my god, the salmon looks kind of sad. So this is the weighing counter where I'm going to weigh the loose items that I took here. Kat bawang dekat mana ya? Bawang. Bawang. Oh, okay. Tadi tak nampak. Kasih. 
Just now, a lady approached me and asked me if she can give me free tomato. Um, I don't know, I guess so. But anyway, I was just about to show you. I want to get my beef now. This is my favorite section because it's all meat. I'm gonna cook spaghetti, so I want to get... Uh, maybe this one? I just go for the cheapest. I this one. I need chicken breast. So... Oh! Oh, okay. Oh. So these are cherry tomatoes, right? Yes, we ah. call it mini tomatoes. Ah, mini tomato. It's planted in Cameron Highland using Japanese technology and Japanese farmer. It's more taste like a fruit. Ah, so it's sweeter? Yes, it is very sweet. Ah, okay. okay. Thank you. Oh my god, I got free tomato. Okay, that was really awkward. But for all the vegans, maybe you can skip my video right now because I'm going to show you something. Maybe you would think it's inhumane, but I think it's really interesting. So, these chickens, before they were slaughtered, they listened to Mozart. So I guess they are happier. Oh my god. Alright, so I'm gonna get this one for 8 ringgit 61 cents. Okay, next is for the dry stuff. I see my eggs, but first I need my trash bags. Some really cheap ass ones because I'm donating to my rental house. So I'm getting black color back. And special ones for myself. That is lemongrass smell. Um, um, you can't really smell it once I open it, but well, it's a bit nicer for my own room, I guess. I'm gonna go and get eggs. Okay, so I'm at the eggs section. All of the eggs here, they have it in like big crates, but I don't need that. I only need like this kind. I usually get just like the new three plus one. <laughs> okay. So this auntie is recommending me eggs. <laughs> Ah, uh, this L. Oh. This L. Almost That means nothing. Almost done. This jumbo. Jumbo is our company's jumbo. It has six legs. It has ten legs. This is Omega Three. Ah, can. This is not Omega. Okay. Thank okay. you. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank I'm gonna get the whole meal one. So I'm getting the healthier option, which is the whole meal one. This is five hundred and forty-nine cents. Which button mushroom? So the brand of button mushroom that I usually get is not here, but I'm just gonna get it anyway because um, I'm too lazy to go to the other side of the mall for Jaya Gosa. I usually get a wholesome. And Alisan was like controversial a couple of years ago, but I guess it's okay. Oh, and I also think it's really important to show you milk um, because almost everyone drinks milk. I personally don't because I'm kind of like lactose like, intolerant. So unlike places that I've been to, say like in Russia or the Netherlands or even Washington, there's a lot of milk for you to choose from. We don't. So we only have these. These are all like smaller packets. Oh my gosh, I see Milo, that's like my childhood favorite. So this is Dutch Lady Full Cream. One liter for about 6 ringgit 63 cents. Um, there's also like brands like Good Day. Yeah, these are the varieties that we have. So milk that I drink is usually like oat milk or almond milk. But in Aeon, I don't think they have that. I think they only have like soy milk. And also in case you're wondering about our dairy selection, we have some, not a lot, and it's mostly imported. Cheese section. I don't know what cheese to show you guys to gauge, but you can just look at the price here and figure it out yourself. This is like my childhood cheese slices, which my German friend calls it fake cheese, but I don't know. Parmesan. And here we have the chilled milk, also the yogurt. Honestly, I miss dairy. 
but it's for the best. However, whenever I travel, I still tend to try their dairy products because it's usually a lot fresher and I just can't resist. Oh, I need pets. Okay, I'm here at the sanitary pet section. Thank you, Lainia. Actually, I don't remember which of these three that I got. But I know it's unscented. So this one says it's unscented. This one is antibacterial. Shouldn't all of it be antibacterial? And this is 100% cotton. I think I'll just go with the unscented one. Okay, so this is usually the one that I get for night time. It's the 30cm one and I can see that they have jumbo pack. But I have to see really properly because I like the one with green. Now I'm at the tissue box section. Usually the more expensive ones are Royal Gold and also Kleenex. I usually get just like Premier, that's the most expensive I'll go. Otherwise I would just get like the supermarkets um, brand but they don't have any Aeon brand here. 12 ringgit 49 for like this much. And obviously you can see the Royal Gold is more expensive than the Kleenex. Oh Premier, they only have this like limited edition packaging this is the raya packaging or eid as you call it so since young my dad always taught us to calculate the value of each not ply like each single tissue paper i guess so that they don't get to con you and that's what i'm going to do now 1349 divided by there is 70 times 4 680, 13.49 divided by 600, 0.019, divided by 400, 0.02, yeah, so the Kleenex per tissue paper is 0.026 cents, it's not a lot, uh, yeah, I'll get the premium one. Salamat Hari Raya, I'm gonna get this one because I'm in the need for Eid. Okay, that is all I need for my groceries today, but I must show you the sauce aisle because when I was in the US, all I could find was ketchup, mustard, and mayo, or sriracha, but let me show you our selection. So we have the oyster sauce, mushroom sauce, light soy sauce, dark soy sauce, peri peri sauce. We have the chili sauce and tomato sauce here as well. I'm not going to show you the mustard and mayo because it's on the other aisle and I just want to leave right now. So let's go and pay up. Right now I'm done with my groceries. I have it all here. I think I'm going to get myself some coffee because it's been a while. Okay, so I'm done with my groceries and today I spent 122 ringgit on 19 items. I hope you enjoyed grocery shopping with me. Let me know how much a crate of eggs or like a bunch of bananas cost in your country in the comments down below and then we can compare. And so I just got myself some coffee from Gigi Coffee. This is the buttercream latte. I know I say I don't take dairy but today is a very rare day and I heard really good things about this from my friend. So I'm gonna try it. So good. So, so good. And it's not very sweet too. And it's only for freaking 12 ringgit, okay? Cheap. Cheap. It's been a few hours since my camera battery died in the car and I got myself a vaccine shot. I just came back so I just wanted to thank you for watching. I hope that you enjoyed following me around grocery shopping today and getting awkward unwanted attention from the sellers. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching and subscribe to this channel for more travel videos in the future.